Yes, yes. Oh, your life. Oh, that was brilliant. Thank you. Well, do you enjoy that? Yes! Hey. That was fantastic. <clears throat> that. Oh, that was a track from your new album, Allow Me To Be Frank. That was, that was to be frank. Can Not you yours. manage on that couch? Just, just, just about, yeah. <laughs> Can I have a new couch, please? I'm embarrassed with me guests. <laughs> Paul, it feels like we're waiting on a, on a, for a bus or something. It is. It's like being on the back of an old chatter. That's what we were, we were all here last night singing, if you're happy and you know we clap your hands. <laughs> if you're happy and you know we clap your hands. No, no, no more can be that song. <laughs> Why have you decided to change direction and go into all the easy listening? Um, just for just for a bit of spice, you yeah. know. They say you know, spice is the variety of life. Yeah. Oh, I got that totally. Back. <laughs> you got that right. Hang on. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm trying to say. Spice is the smell. Of, what was it? Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> I, I think you were right. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> you want to sweet it? <laughs> no. Um, to be honest with you, we just kind of thought we always had the idea of doing a themed album. Uh, for our next album, kind of a, f a few months back, and uh, when we sat down and started talking about ideas and stuff like that, we came up with a duets idea, and we were kind of thinking that was going to be a bit hard to do. And you know, we came up with a few other ideas, and then actually, when Brian left the band, we did some TV shows as a four-piece. And uh, our manager Louis and Simon, they kind of said we looked like a, a young rap pack. That gave you us do, yeah. the natural <laughs> idea to kind of say, well, <laughs> rap pack. And, then we went in, recorded a few songs. The demos turned it out, turned out absolutely brilliant. So, but it is brilliant. Yeah. It looks like a tin of sardines. Or the I know that. Yeah. Yeah. Sean, do you want to get? Do you want that little chair? No, 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 no. I was looking at that earlier on. Actually, that's a, is that a, like a footstool? But sign that's for me to collapse. Someone have skipped. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they have been playing golf for three-year-olds and all this, and darts with six-year-olds. Heard he was very good though. What the skipping? No, the, the golf. Oh, the golf. <laughs> the three -year -olds. It wasn't bad, was it? I mean, he knocked oh, he socks off me. That little kid today playing golf. Sick. He hit the ball 110 years. <laughs> Who did? Three-year-olds. Three-year-olds. <laughs> Elton Bowles out in the night ago, and I was like, stood there, Morsi fight, thinking, please, <laughs> turn the cameras off, turn the cameras off. <laughs> now, listen, you've, you've made a TV show because you're looking for a female vocalist. That's right, yeah. We did uh, auditions for... It was actually for our album as well. And we went around auditioning for a fan to sing on our album and to sing... Uh, what's that? <laughs> 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 the way you look tonight. The way, the way you, you look tonight. tonight. That's it. Is she no. going to join the band then? No, she's not. No, it's just for the TV show and she's on the album. Basically, the prize is you get on the album, obviously, forever, and then uh, you're on the TV show. And have you well. found her now? We have, yeah. 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 She's from what's Bolton. She like? She's very good, very yeah. excellent singer, yeah. Her name is Joanne. Joanne. And she's from Bolton. So How are your fans going to cope? How are you going to cope, girls, with a female in the band? <laughs> yeah? I'll tell you why, because you've got, well, you've got some, like, pretty obsessive fans, haven't you? <laughs> now, listen to this is off your message board on your, on your... Oh. I hope you're in the audience. I really hope. Listen to this one. Excuse me, Gemma Egan. Chapman is your name. Don't write things under my name again. All right, you are obsessed with Kian and he is minging. <laughs> <laughs> and then we go. By the way, Carly, Kian is not minging, so before you speak, get your facts right. OK, I'm Nicky Egan. I love you, Kian. John Francis Egan. Will you marry me? I wish you all the best. <laughs> And then we have, by the way, Nicky Egan, hey, whatever. Look at all this. Is there. <laughs> Kane wouldn't marry you if you were the last girl on the planet. So if I were you, don't ask him again. Anyway, Kane is getting married to Jodie Alba, so go and get a laugh, you sad, sad person. She doesn't, <laughs> she doesn't say person, but I can't repeat it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it goes on and on and on. How do you oh, cope funny. with them? We don't read it. <laughs> <laughs> but we've had some here. We've had, you, but you've got, like, this huge fan base. You've got an 80-year-old, uh, 81-year-old lady here who's written in. She's in hospital. Her name's Ines Roberts, and she's had some trouble with her heart, and it's her birthday. Will you do us a favour? Wish her happy birthday. Of course. Ines, are you watching? Ines, Ines. You watching? <clears throat> happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hope you're well, well soon. I might as well get them all out the way, because I'll get lynched if I don't. <laughs> right. uh, here's one. Uh, uh, she's 70, and she's a huge... 17, she's a huge fan of yours. She's got T-shirts, books, posters. I can't wait to meet this lady. <laughs> and, uh, oh, she doesn't say her name, but it's love from Gemma Cartwright. So will you say hello to Gemma Cartwright? Hello, Gemma. Hello, Gemma. Hello, Gemma. And one last one. 27-month-old uh, grandson, Connor, is obsessed with you. He loves the bones here. Will you give Connor a big hand? All right, Connor. Right, Connor. Connor. <laughs> hello, everybody else watching. <laughs> I'm sorry about... It's like two-way family favourites on this show. I'm sorry, lads. No more requests, please. Now... Hello to everybody in the audience as well. It's my show. I'm the boss. I say what goes. None of those Richard and Judy flannel on this. <laughs> <laughs> it was in the paper early in the week. They've got Madonna. They can have her. We wouldn't have her. Neither would this morning. <laughs> We're bored with her, please, with the cabalism, whatever she's into these days. Now, Sligo. Apparently there's a, a Westlife museum. Is there? Yes. Well, not necessarily a museum, 
What it was was uh, uh, there's a guy in Sligo who is a, a Westlife collector and uh, he put an exhibition on of our stuff, of all the stuff that he's been collecting from Westlife for the last six years. And now he's donated it to the Sligo Museum and they're going to make a kind of like a gallery for it. So we're and very get, proud of that. Do you get all your fans going over to Sligo? Yeah. Mm. You two are very quiet. Don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Bears, <laughs> you're embarrassing me. Get me on your I, I let him talk there. Get a bit of pressure. How are you, Paul? Are you well? <laughs> very well. I'll tell you what we've got here. We've got these. Oh, <laughs> you know what, actually? I don't, I don't actually have a set of those. So if you're not doing that with the end of can I have them? Of course you can have them. Oh, hold on. I asked the producer before the show. Oh, this is Which one? <laughs> There's going Which to be a fight after, after the show. Up? Uh, good question. We're all the same with the, just different hairstyles. That's how I look. You guess. That's no, you've you actually got Brian yeah. instead of Keen there. No, he doesn't. No. 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 Who's that one? That's that was supposed Brian to be me. No, that's Keen. Oh, no, did you ever have grey hair? I know. <laughs> <laughs> and who's this one? That's Nicky. It's, that's you. That's no, you. No, no, that's Nicky, actually. That's you. No, that's not, because it's that's the point that wings out. Here, have a look and sure. sort them out yeah, yourself. Yeah, and who's this little smiley fella there on this issue? Is this your mark? <laughs> look at him, look, look, yeah. look. I love the position with the hands down like a little second. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm wearing China pants, look. China pants. China? What's these? They're all the same China what pants, made oh, in China. Oh, in China pants. Oh, yeah, you can have them, then. Oh, look, Don't be taking them stripping your dolly off, yeah, please. <laughs> Oh, on TV. Here you go. Give me a strip on telly for you. <laughs> <laughs> now, Shane, what have you spent? Tried to spend a grand on a can of pop. I can't <laughs> oh, yeah, I know, no, no, no. That, that was just a joke. It was a joke. We were in a, an airport flying from uh, Hong Kong. No, we were flying from London to Hong Kong. It was like a thirteen-hour trip, and we were out the night before till about seven in the morning. So we went straight to the airport, and we were dying, like we were hanging, like so. We ended up. Uh, I got off the plane like hanging, haven't it? That word for ages. No, but my mouth was just like felt like it was full of sand, like so. I got off. Like, and I was, like, like Andy's flip flop. Like Andy's flip flop, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I was like, uh, I was like, I give anyone, I give anyone a gram for a, a can of coke, but it was a, it was a figure of speech. Yeah. Oh, right. oh, so I would have given a hundred quid for it though. Yeah. No. No. I was dying for a drink. And you bought a helicopter, haven't you? I did, yeah, yeah, I did. A, Can a, you fly it? No, no, not Are you yet. gonna have lessons? Eventually, yeah, hopefully. Well, listen, I'm having flying lessons. It's a doggle. Is it? <laughs> you can have that. Oh, we are. No. Hey! <laughs> look at that. Look, look. Can I take my notes? Here, I'll have it. Yeah, you can have it, because you haven't got them, have you, so? No, I don't, actually. Shove them in the museum in Sligo. Yes. There you go, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. look at them. But these aren't the original ones, you know. <laughs> look at them sitting up. The original ones, you press the belly, they sing. But these don't sing, these ones. These are the cheaper, you got the cheap version. How'd you cut them? It's typical on this show. You know, <laughs> Richard and Judy, they would have got the ones oh. <laughs> Richard and Judy, you'd have got millions of quid for doing this, <laughs> or onto the papers. You get a scented candle off us and a bunch of mouldy flowers rubbed off the page. I have a bottle of champagne. A bottle of champagne. Look what I get. A cup of tea that looks like ten year old Guinness. You could trot a mouse across that. <laughs> That'd be sick. Listen, fellas, good luck with the new album. Thank you, thank you. Are you on tour anywhere? Yeah, we uh, start yeah. on um, February the 1st. Uh, it's called the Red Carpet Tour, and we start in Belfast. Yeah. And uh, we're all over the UK and Ireland as well. So, um, yeah, we're looking forward to it, because um, touring is always the best part for us, you know. It's nice to get out there. And, and this year, obviously, we'll have a section of the Rat Pack stuff as well, um, as well as all the old Westlife stuff. So what other songs are you doing on the album? Uh, we've, got, we've, we've got quite a few. We've got uh, 13 tracks, and we've done uh, Fly Me To The Moon, obviously. Uh, Mac The Knife, Ain't That A Kick In The Head. Oh, Moon River, uh, When I Fall In Love, yeah. Summer Wind. Let There, there Be Love, yeah, That's yeah, Life. Come fly well, by the album. And go and see him on tour. <laughs> Let's hear the please for Westlife. Smashing Bumps and Bellies. Thank you. Come on. Don't be throwing knickers. Don't be throwing knickers. I warned them before you came up. Oh, there it is. Is she your mother? <laughs> <laughs> now.